Hi, I'm Sam at Shaper HQ. Today I'm here with the Shaper Origin prototype and in this demonstration we're going to look at tracing shapes live on the tool. Here we're going to take this element, we're going to trace it and then cut it out so that we can fit it into this piece of ply. Um, so just quickly hold it there. So there's our line. Now I'm going to take the tool and scan. Because the tool's using a camera to scan in these fiducials, at the same time I'm recording that line I just made. Now it's going to save. And once it's done that, we'll be able to zoom in and then use the on tool pen. There we go. So now we can place with the pen tool. I'm just finding the corners and tracking them and just putting points down. So now that's, uh, that's going to cut on the outside of that line. So we'll use offset as well to uh, send it inwards. Negative 0.25. We'll cut it on the line. Okay. So that might be too much. So we're going to do this at quarter of an inch deep and then start cutting. I'll quickly do a uh, touch off just to check we're at the right height as well. So you saw a touch off was a quick two button operation and it moves the Z, uh, the bit in Z till it touches the work surface, which then gives us a uh, known Z equals zero position that we can repeat. Uh, and use as a reference. Very quick, very easy and keeps us productive. So here we are cutting out our 4x2 slot. We're advantaged by our corners enabling us to marry up with that fillet in the corner of the 4x2 so we don't need to add any uh, corner relief details or dog bones in the corners. So I've put this down to just over half an inch. Just do a little auto mode around that corner. This will be a full depth pass and it will cut out a tight fitting, maybe too tight fitting hole. So I've cut our element out. It looks like we're pretty close to that line. We might have might have a little more to remove so we can just handle that with the offset so so as we move our offset outwards we'll see our line move along with it so I'll cut another pass at the full depth so with that extra two hundredths Added, you can see the cut history, the green element is now crossing the line, which should give us uh, more breathing room to fit our 4x2 into this slot. Perfect.